What's up guys, Panda here from Panda Gaming and welcome back to EA Sports UFC 3. We're going to be using Yakare Souza in the middleweight division. Taking on Anderson Silva. This should be, uh, should be a solid fight. Uh, Anderson's usually like to kick. Uh, kicking is no good against, you know, somebody like Souza. Trying to swerve on him a bit. Okay, okay, slow down, slow down. Slow dancing a bit. I think it's interesting he's standing right in front of me with low block. Here's that kick attempt we're going to talk about. Oh, went for a double leg takedown. Went for a nice double leg takedown, but didn't get it. Now he's seeking a nice double leg halfway through round one. Uh, I messed that up. I accidentally hit up before he ever even thought about transitioning. Well, if he can go backside. Oh, full guard. You should have got up, buddy. That was a mistake. we we'll slap on a triangle choke. Man, if this was Donald Cerrone's triangle, it would be beautiful. That's it, baby. That's a wrap. Souza gets his win over Anderson Silva. You just can't. You just can't mess around on the ground with Souza. He's too good. He's Damian Maya, except with better striking. All right, guys. We're gonna get us another fight with Souza. We'll be right back. All right, guys. Welcome back. We're gonna be using Souza again in the middleweight division, taking on a Luke Rockhold. Now, Luke Rockhold's usually like to kick, which is good for me. So we'll see. See what this old Luke wants to do, how he wants to attack us. There's a kick, and there's a takedown. All right, let's go. Now, Luke has a good off-the-back stats. You know, his ground game is pretty good. With his perks, he's got like 101 top control, I think. It's ridiculous. I'll have to check that. So don't, don't fact check me and be like, Panda, you're crazy. I'm pretty sure he's got like 98 top game. And then once you get past the top game, he has a perk that's like once you're in a dominant position, it's plus three or something. I don't know. It's something like that. We're just going to hold him down, land some good ground and pound. Maybe even go for a Kimura now. It seems like a good time. I let him get too far on that first gate for sure. That's it, baby. Just like that. Good job, Souza. Tapping out Luke Rockhold with the Kimura. I thought I let him get too far that first gate, but we recovered in the third gate. Made it really nice setting up for that final push. Way to go. All right. I like that. Get a takedown. One for one on the subs. Let's go, baby. Let's get us another fight with Souza. All right, guys, we're back. Going to be taking on the Style Bender in our final fight. I want to say thank you guys for tuning in, checking out this video. Please hit that like button for me. You know, 100 likes is a good goal. I think right now, 100 likes every single video, it's just, it's, that's nothing, man. It's nothing. You guys have been killing it. So thank you so much for doing that and watching and hanging out. I appreciate it. It really, you know, gets me fired up to make these videos for you guys. Now, using Souza against the Style Bender. I can basically eliminate the kicks, okay? Because if you start throwing kicks against a ground opponent, eventually they're going to get you to the ground with one of them kicks. So, we just got to worry about his boxing, his size a little bit, and we'll go from there. 
See what he wants to do at the start of this fight. I'll spit off a little leg kick. He threw one, and we, ooh, baby, he knew. Good job, good job, good job. Throw another one. Oh, one, two, we'll eat it. Try to lull him asleep a little bit. Good job checking that leg kick. I knew he'd be denying a takedown. Opened up a bit more. Nice leg kick. Let's go. Firing those leg kicks off today. You know, letting him know, hey, I'm not afraid to strike. You know, we're going to strike with you a little bit. Good job switching feet. Firing off some more leg kicks. I don't like standing like this. Oh, baby, there we go. And instead of going for a normal takedown, I push him up against the cage. Why? I'm not real sure. I just did. Just because sometimes I do that. <laughs> Let's go body lock high, and we finally get that takedown we've been looking for. Now that we're in this position, you know, I don't like to be still for too long. I don't like to sit and wait. So we rolled him over. You know, he's probably going to try to escape left or right. Oh, no, he's going to try to pull us down. Yes, baby. Let's go. Does he get back up? He doesn't get right back up, which is, might cost him in the end. Might not. It might. Who knows? But now that we got him in this position, we can deny some transitions, punch him in the face. We got a triangle. We got a guillotine. We got all kinds of things we can work with. Let's go straight up triangle. Oh, good job denying that. Odds are he's probably not going to punch. And he gets up. Throw another inside leg kick. Good body kick. Okay, he rocks him with that one. Oh, okay. Whew, good thing we were blocking because that would have hurt. We need to get out of this position. I don't like being stuck right here. Ah, uh, here we go. All right. Good defense here, Joe. Is the hook to the head is blocked. A little one-two. Beautiful strike there. All right. Good ending to the round. Good round all together. Um, we could improve on our groundwork, to be honest. Uh, the striking seemed to go okay. We got rocked there at the end, but we did rock him. Uh, ground game wise, we can make a few improvements. Fighting a Souza, you know, you know what he's looking for. A dash and got a nice takedown. We're gonna deny that. Hit him multiple times. He's probably waiting for that Kimura. We didn't allow him to get that Kimura. Let's go back side. Here we go. Back mount. Couldn't get it. Let's look in that bulldog choke. See what we can do. Ah, I messed that up. My fault. It's all right, though. Now he's got to worry about that instead of back mount. Okay, he's going to do a little bit of both. Back mount. All right, finally got him. <laughs> Finally got him in the back, man. Let's go for an arm bar. Okay, I don't know what happened right there. It kind of froze. That was kind of weird, but all right. Full guard. Can't put him in it. Full guard, we can. All right. If I was him, I would have tried to get out immediately. Uh, but he didn't. He let me get my stamina back. Pull him back down to full guard. That's not going to build you up a grapple advantage, so I'm not for sure. You know, it's, I mean, it's landing good strikes. Let's deny that. Pull him back down. Let's 
I don't have a twister, do I? Ah, that's unfortunate. There we go, triangle choke. Baby, we tapped out the style bender with a nasty triangle. Let's go! Oh, right, that's what's up. Nice job. We had to just, we had to just wait, just wait a little bit longer. We finally got that opportunity we were looking for, and we were able to tap him out. Let's go! All right, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate that. Don't forget to share this video, like it, do everything you can. I really appreciate it. You guys are the best. We'll see you at the next one.